Yo, what's up YouTube? Welcome back to my channel. I really do appreciate you guys for coming back to check me out. I am Archie Beats and I'm here to help. Before we get started, if you guys are a singer, producer, songwriter, rapper, engineer, or just a content creator that like to make a lot of sound and make money off that sound, please subscribe to my channel because I'm going to be giving out a lot of vital information that's going to help you on your music and creative journey. And today we're doing an unboxing of this Roscoe right here, the Silverback Sound Cage Pro. And the reason why I bought a new sound reflector shit or sound reflector filter, whatever you want to call it, is because my SE, I have two of them at the house. They're really heavy and I just wanted to get something that was collapsible and I need something lighter and from the specs, it's like a hundred times lighter than my SE. So I didn't want to bring that with me while I'm on the road traveling. And as you guys can see, I do have my portable mobile rig behind me and I'm gonna do a tour of that very soon as well. And guys, keep in mind, if you like anything that you have seen in my home studio back at my home in Atlanta, uh, be sure to click below because I am an Amazon influencer and I have everything listed on that link below. And not only do I have things in my home studio, but I have the studio gear that I suggest and the studio gear that I've worked with in the past. So guys, what are we waiting for? Let's get right to it. Here it is. Now we're not gonna use a box cutter, we're gonna rip it with our hands because we got some incredible Hulk action going on here. I am a strong guy. <laughs> so yeah, the box is really big, so I'm hoping it's not this big. Um, like I said, the point of getting this, although I have two of the sound forges, oh, it's a tiny little box. Although I have two of the sound forges, I like sound forges, the SE. You guys see my home studio right here. Then I have an old one and I have a new one. I like the new one better because um, it's actually, it seems a little more sturdier and the pieces seem more solid. But this right here, it's just something for me to be able to carry on the road. And guys, guess what? It is smaller. Already my SE <laughs> sound reflector um, pro is so huge that um, it's like really, to, it's really hard to move around, but yeah. So you can see, and I got some muscle action. Listen guys, here go another tutorial. If you guys don't have any scissors or keys or anything like that, you press that box right there at the corner, and you can rip that tape right off, just like that. Look at there. I'm no Tim Allen, but you know, I'm <laughs> pretty close with the home improvement. Oh, and guys, like I said, it's collapsible. So this is what I am talking about. Oh man, look at this. Look at this. It actually wraps around. It's actually a lot bigger than my sound forge. Well, my SE um, sound reflector fi um, filter that's at home, it's actually, it's about the size of this. This isn't as heavy, but um, wow. Look at that gorilla on there. Let's go ahead and tear this open really quick and um, let's see what we have here. Oh, wow. And like I said, guys, it is collapsible. I think I'm gonna um, recommend this, guys. Wow. Look at the dome around it. Holy smokes. Like I said, I can tell off bat it's not as sturdy as the SE sound reflector, but it looks really cool. It's portable. Now we're gonna test out the sound. I'm gonna post another video, so you guys be looking out this week for me to post a video to give you guys a comparison of with it and without it. And I'm gonna do different room sizes just to give you guys an idea. But I'm telling you, if you have a home studio and you want something really small and light, right now this thing like this is going to get the job done. So yeah, yeah guys, it looks really cool. And this thing right here is basically what your microphone is gonna go on. It's gonna screw onto there. Now I'm gonna be using my TLM and my normal U87 with this. So I'm really excited about that. And as you can see, the wind is picking up here in these mountains, but we don't care. We're trying to get some information out to you guys because that's what this is about. So guys, here it is. And they said in the description that it can hold any mic, any weight mic, any mic stand. It can fit anything. So I tested on my cheapest mic stand with my most expensive microphone, which is the Norman U87. So you guys know I must trust it because it's a $3,500 microphone and I don't want to see that take a tumble or hit the 
ground and be destroyed. And it's my favorite microphone in my locker. I'm also gonna check my TLM because it's a little shorter, but it has the same size diaphragm as the 87. But guys, it looks really good. It's wide, it's collapsible. I can even close it in some more if I wanted to. As you guys can see, that is pretty sturdy. Um, I'm gonna get some sandbags and different things like that to put at the bottom of this um, round base mic stand. But guys, it looks good. And guess what? I did a little test with the foam, not through the microphone, but I'm actually gonna do a video to give you guys like different examples of how it sounds with it and how it sounds without it. But guys, it looks really good. It feels really good. It's really light. It's really inexpensive. Guys, you won't believe that it's only $59, $59.99 and it's collapsible. You can pretty much fold it up and throw it in your luggage, but it's really, really portable. And I can't wait to do my portable studio to show you guys my gear that I travel with with, and I'm definitely going to be traveling with this and I do recommend it. It will be listed below in my Amazon influencer store. And like I said earlier, if you guys like anything that you've seen in my home studio, make sure that you guys um, check it out. I have a lot of cool gear on there and a lot of stuff that I recommend for you guys to use. So guys, I really do appreciate it. You guys are awesome. You guys are great. And also, if you guys want me to do a video to show you how to install this on the mic stand, I will definitely do that as well. So comment below and just let me know and I'll be happy to do that for you guys. Don't forget to subscribe. Don't forget to follow me on Instagram at Archie Beats and Twitter at Archie Beats. You guys are phenomenal. Um, I appreciate everything. Have a wonderful day. This is your boy Archie Beats and I'm signing off.